What? I no. What the hell are you doing? Why would you climb into the? I didn't do that. How's it going, guys? My name is Mega Miles, and welcome to I assume a new Let's Play again. Oh my God! What did I press? I didn't mean to do that. But it's called the Long Dark. Oh, it just went to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I was adjusting all the settings, but um. I'm pretty sure it's like a survival based game, which is super awesome for me because, uh, episode one, do not go gentle. Mackenzie and Dr. Greenwood are separated after their plane crashes deep in the Northern Canadian wilderness. This is fucking weird. I'll explain in a second. Struggling to survive, Mackenzie explores the small town of Milton where he begins to understand the scope of this quiet apocalypse. Okay. so. The reason why I was interested in this game, one, it was super popular on Steam, but two, it really resembled a, one of my favorite books I read as a child, or a young kid of all time. It's called Hatchet. I kid you not, single plane, a little prop, crashes in the Canadian wilderness, and I, I, I just saw the photo here. It's called Hatchet. He has a hatchet. It's written by Gary Paulson, one of the best books I've ever read amazing and uh like all of gary paulson's books are fucking awesome i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm not super into reading but i'll leave a link in the description for you guys um but yeah so i don't know exactly how similar it's gonna be i don't think it's gonna be similar to it but i just figured it might bring back some memories of my younger childhood so without further ado let us get into the shit So, our plane's already crashed, I assume. Yes. By the way, Mackenzie was named Brian and Hatchet. Just saying. Do I need to push something? It won't. Haven't you seen, seen Game of Thrones? Nothing can break me. Are the the northern lights? Awesome. Astrid! Ow! Ah, uh, what is that? Can I get it out? What the fuck do I need to do? How do I heal myself? I'm working on it. Hold on, guys. Remove metal. Tap the A. 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 This is it. This isn't fucking uh, Walking Dead. I don't need to A this shit too much. Oh, I'm healed perfectly. Look, I already have stitches. The long dark. So, uh, I would recommend staying... I would recommend staying by the fire and building a shelter near the fire because that makes more sense. I'm just saying, I, I might be a survival expert. No, it's okay. We just drop off this way. Oh shit, that might not be a good idea. How do I run? That's the most important thing. That's crap. I don't, I can't jump. Uh, gotta go this way. I wish we could have seen the plane crash. Like, start with an intro with a cutscene. Fire. Fire provides heat. No shit. Water, food, and protection? How? Use a campfire to start. Oh, maybe we need, but we're not in the ocean. Usually, like if uh, you like if you're stranded on an island, you would heat the water to evaporate. What or I don't to kill. I don't know how to survive. Just like whatever. Ignore what I just said. But anyway, so uh, an active fire can be used to cook, boil water. Oh yeah, so you still boil the water here even I guess. So we have a cave. Um, there's bones in here, so can we sleep here? What do I do? Nothing? We need to bring a fire in here. So can I harvest this? Oh god, temperature is dropping. I, uh, do I have an inventory thing? I have socks. I, uh, first aid. 
We need to find a bandit. I wish I could run. That would be nice. Chill the fuck out, man! There's a- oh, there's a mat. Hold on. Hold on. I don't need to start a fire. I need tinder and fuel. Oh, here's a stick. Pick up that stick, girl. No, we're not! We're not gonna bleed out! Put the matches away, dude! We don't need those anymore. Fucking pick it up! Breaking down? To what? What did I break it down into? What is this? Is this another stick? Nope. Dude, chill the fuck out, Mackenzie. You have a woman's name. Oh, there's a first aid kit. Awesome. Did, did I? There's a scroll. Alright. Oh, wait. Let's take it. And then, uh, I'll take the cloth, and I'll take the newsprint. And then I'll take yes. this. Chill the fuck out. I need the cardboard box, Metal Gear Solid style. Alright. I think we're making good progress. I know how to survive. Trust me, guys. We're gonna go in here. We're gonna pick this up. What is this? Cedar firewood. Awesome. You know, it's really cool that everything's left just perfectly for us. Alright, so, uh, let's place this here. I like this. I am placing it. it. This is not apparently a good spot. Too far away to place. Oh, okay. Asshole. Uh,. Fire starting. Okay, shit. No. Well, let's just go. Don't worry about it. We're gonna start this fire. Gary Paulson taught me well. Well. Sorry, just spit ice and I almost hit the camera. But yeah, seriously, there's like an entire chapter in Hatchet where he's trying to start a fire. It's really cool. Like, it's a it's a shorter read. Just trust me. It's 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 a really awesome book. And me, I thank goodness for that. Yeah, you're welcome. I uh I never ever recommend books, so just trust me. Uh, gotta stop that bleeding. So let's uh we have a claw. How do we stop the bleeding? Clothes used for hold on. No, don't want that. No, stop! So apparently, I guess we gotta find more materials to be able to heal our bleeding. Or did we already do it? I guess not. Okay. So let's look. What the fuck is this? A stick? I'll, I will take that stick. I will take the cardboard box. Break it down, girl. I swear, if we bleed out, I'm gonna be so pissed off. What is this? I heard. I saw something. Branch. No. Bro! Alright, we're gonna really have to analyze this. Hold on. Um, so, yeah, we are gonna die. But we have a claw. I just don't see. I searched the first aid kit. And, like anything, first aid. Bro! Tell me what to do! I got fire starting, I got clothing. I got material, how do I, uh... Fuck me, man. We're gonna bleed out soon. <laughs> uh, I don't need to start a... No, get your matches away! Mackenzie! Mackenzie! Mackenzie, we're gonna die because... Mackenzie, put that away. No, other... Fuck me. Alright, I guess we died. We're gonna die. Cedar firewood. We don't really need that right now. We need to fucking figure out how to heal ourselves. Oh my god, I'm getting so dizzy. Can I fucking heal myself yet? Hold on. Let's see this. Oh wait, my bad. Uh, first aid. Nothing. Nothing. Hold on. Oh my god. Yep, we're dead. We're for sure dead. So, oh wait, hold on. We gotta... Oh, there we go. Now we can craft. Oh my god, bandage. Craft that shit, girl. Woo! I told you, I read Hatchet. Now, we can go back and we can craft our medical supplies. Left hand. Yes, we did it! Just took me an hour and a half, but we should be good now. That's all I Healed. have in me. Need to lay down before I fall down. Yeah, thanks, Mackenzie. Oh, we're good. 
taking a nap. 100%, totally fine. Day two, we survived day one. If you survive the plane crash, you're kind of a badass. So thirsty. Gotta be a way to melt some snow. Do we have a pot? Okay, when you bring up quick stats or the radio menu, you'll get a preview of your current condition as well as information about how cold, tired, and hungry and thirsty you are. Anytime one of these status indicators is empty and red means you're losing condition, lose all your condition, and you'll die. All right, so um, most important is uh, stuck here a while. Better see what I can use. If we get snow, we have to boil it. We can't just melt it down. We know that's empty. Um, but we also need to craft some kind of weapon because we're gonna get hungry soon. Yeah, I know, dude. Chill the fuck out. Reclaim the wood. We gotta take everything. Was there anything in there? Yes, of course. Wood matches. And, uh, what is this? Water purification tablet. So we don't have to boil it. Cool. Um. Nothing is in there? Oh, we got some shit. Alright, so, uh. Chill out, bro. Got a. Whatever that is. Reclaimed wood. Nice. Mmm. Fire accelerant? Cool. So we'll be able to light a fire without tinder is what that means. Call me the survival expert Mega Miles. There's the book. Um, one thing I'm really curious about since we're tr essentially trapped up here is we're going to eventually have to find a way down this path. So we need to chill the fuck out, man. You just crashed. Get your shit together. We can't hunt right now. You're gonna have to starve for a little bit. So, there's no other path, right? We can't climb up anywhere, can we? No. We need to All find right. Some place to escape this cold. We have a cave, dude. Chill out, man. I get that we're stuck in the wilderness, but it's a game, dude. You can fucking give me some direction. Damn. Freezing. No shit, man. You want me to get you a fucking blanket? No, I don't have a blanket. We're seriously just gonna fucking go. Um, watch this. I died from massive internal injuries from falling two fucking feet. Are you fucking kidding me? What? Did you got? I was so careful. I so careful. Fuck you, man. You're not gonna eat a damn horse. Better see what I can use. I already. Oh. There we go. Alright, now it's good. Hold on. Water. Melt snow. How do I get snow? How do I get snow? Oh! What? Oh, cool. I didn't even know I had a bucket. Well, at least now we know how to craft snow. So we do have a container. Water unsafe. Purify water. So we're purifying the water. Alright, we're fine. So we got water purification tablets. And now we can use our quick. Oh shit. Oh my god. I pushed the wrong button. We can use this to drink water, right? Is that what I just did? Oh, there we go. And then. Oh shit. There we go. Now we're drinking. Now we're, we feel better. Mission, journal updated, but I don't know how to fucking, uh, let me warm up real quick. I have no idea where to get food. I'm sure an animal will appear. Where can I find something to eat? Ah, uh, you fucking tell me, dude, and I'll fucking get it. Or figure out how to fucking jump. Oh, I gotta hold this, are you serious? Are you serious? It's been here this entire fucking time? God. I've been here an hour. And I just had to hold down the button. I didn't know you had to hold down buttons to search stuff. Ah. Fuck me. It's so easy now. Now we can fucking get out of the fucking 
training tutorial thing. God damn it. Now I have to edit all that shit out, man. Okay. So we have the MREs. Feel like Metal Gear Solid. Find some place to escape this cold. Colonel, I need to find some place to escape this cold. What? I should make a campfire. But what about Otacon? And Meryl? Waiting for a fire. Feel like a boy scout. Or maybe a girl scout. Except I don't have girl scout cookies. Maybe I'm a pirate. With a fire. Okay. Alright. So. First priority. Is a uh, melt of snow. How, how many? Let's do two liters this time. Why not? Uh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. So it fucks up our campfire. Okay, good to know. So we're gonna drink the water. So this is like the second tutorial. We're gonna get somewhere where... Come on. It's actually not a tutorial. So we should be good now, and we should be out of the tutorial. We understand how to search for items. That cut smarts? What? What the fuck is he talking about? First aid. Antiseptic. Plane crash injuries. Put that on my chest, girl. I don't feel so good. I need to rest up. Alright, let's do it, dude. Um, Mackenzie is really, really stressing me out. Day three, we're gonna get it. Weather's turning bad. So we're still, uh, we're still in, um, we're still in tutorial mode. So the goal in this episode, which I'm going to have to edit a lot out because I fucked up so much. We're going to have to, uh, just figure out the controls. I'm sorry I keep doing that, but I like Little Bunny Fufu. You don't know Little Bunny Fufu? Little bunny foo foo hopping through the forest. Something up, scooping up the field mice and bopping them on the head. That's how it works. Get that fire going. Oh shit. We gotta figure out uh, some fuel. We need more fuel. Hold on. Got some wood. Plenty of wood. So stupid. I get that it's giving us tutorials, but all of a sudden, there are all these little branches. Let's actually uh, collect as many as we can. My fucking fire bur I fucking, I'm building a new fire. I don't know how realistic this is, but um, I did that, oh my bad. And then right here, and then right here. I swear if this doesn't make a difference, I'm gonna be angry. All right, so now we gotta get our fire full uh, pledge. Yeah, we're good. Mission accomplished, girl. Now what? Day three. Build a fire in the cave that will last the night. Nine hours. So do I really? Oh, you see the timer right there. Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? So we gotta go get more wood. I'll see you guys in a minute. That's stupid. Really? One hour? Oh my god. God, it's gonna take forever! I do like this aspect of the game because, like, remember what I was saying before? We gotta purify it, we gotta boil it. So it's it's really cool the developers knew certain survival techniques before they made the game. Which makes it cool. I like it. So far. The only thing, this tutorial session is very good. However, we don't need to collect this much wood. And then... I'll break this down. Yes! Feel like we're gonna do it this time. Getting a lot of wood. Oh god, I'm freezing to death apparently. That is not good. Where's my fire? Come back. Oh my gosh. Please tell me we're okay. We're fine. Am I starving? No. Oh my god, I almost ran into the fire. Give me all that fuel, girl. 58? Are you serious? What? I, no, what the hell are you doing? 
Why would you climb into the- I didn't do that! Oh, no, I was two minutes away, guys! Oh, you don't know how long that took. Fuck! Alright, it did work. Alright, I think we're good. We're just gonna watch the time on the left. Just where my face is. Maybe I moved it. We're at six hours, seven hours, eight hours, nine hours! Woo! Okay. So don't jump in the fire like you did last time, Mackenzie. That wasn't my fault. It was not my fault. So now it's showing us that we're able to warm up um, with the symbol below. See the little thermometer gauge? Dude, just to, <laughs> just to explain last death, I, I swear to you guys, I didn't jump in the fucking fire. I did not do that. Literally, it pushed me in there. And what did he say? He was like, jump in the fire? I forget. Alright. Sucks that we're still in the uh, tutorial area, but we gotta start somewhere. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this episode. If you did, please leave a like, comment, share this video most importantly so our channel can grow. Uh, yeah, if you, if you haven't, if you don't know about Gary Paulson, it's a short book. It's really short. It, it was made for high school students. I think I read it when I was in sixth grade, if, if that says anything. But like after that, I read the rest of his books because I was so intrigued. I also like got survival manuals and all that jazz. But um, super cool book. Uh, at least at the minimum, check out Hatchet. There's a few sequels to it, I think. Amazing book. This guy like... Like, it's, it's just awesome. It would take you like two hours to read, max. And it, it's totally worth it. Um, and, hypothetically, if, uh, if this ever happened to you, you'd know at least something. Like, you would know to boil your fucking water before you drink it. At least. But, you never know. It might come in handy. Um, but either way, I will see you in the next one.